You can use Pemberton's escape hatch, go into the normal jail cell with your sports bike, and even break the game so that you never get caught in the town. And it's all because of your dog. Now, to do these glitches, you'll have to have your dog leveled up enough to use the handshake trick. The other thing that you'll want is the go-kart from the arcade, the scooter, or the sports bike. Disclaimer, I actually only use the sports bike for this, but the scooter and the go-kart should work as well because they are smaller vehicles. Finally, you'll want food. This is so your dog can do the trick. It won't work if it's hungry. I'm going to start by showing how to use the escape hatch after the fourth story is complete. Step one, you want to make your dog stand in front of the door to the police department, so the doors swing open. Now make your dog stand still. This can be done by opening the dog's menu and pressing the movement button so it looks like this. Step two, drive the vehicle of your choice through the door and repeat this for the second set. Step three, you want to get your dog in the corner. I usually use a ball, but you can do this manually. And this won't work as well if you do the corner by the outside, as this can make Sasquatch walk all the way around rather than into the jail cell. Step four, push the dog using the vehicle. As I said, I only use the sports bike, so if you own it, I would use that, but the scooter or go-kart are cheaper alternatives. You probably won't be able to push your dog fully into Pemberton's cell. At least, I could not. So instead, just push as much as you can and try and squish your dog. Do the handshake trick. There is a chance Sasquatch will walk outside rather than into the cell, but it should work. Now you're in the cell, and you can take a screenshot. I must also warn if your game freezes that this is normal, and it happened to me both times I tested it, but keep in mind that this is not intentionally game designed, so it could theoretically break your game. I would suggest doing this on a separate save file. You will go to the sewers by the pump room when you use the escape hatch, and you'll have to leave the normal way, because there's no ladder going back up to the jail cell. Glitch number two, breaking into your jail cell, and this one requires a little bit of work. First, get your vehicle and dog in the prison just like normal, but now go to the jail cell at the top. This is where you are normally put. Now, just like last time, push your dog. Have a vehicle between you two, and then do the handshake trick. Once you get in the cell, go to sleep. When you wake up, you should get a normal dialogue and leave the cuts. Now your bike should be on the outside of the jail, so just use your dog to get back in. Now you can drive your vehicle into the cell. The next thing you need to do is get caught, as this will also allow you to be in the jail with the bike. Now you have the strange ability to ride around in your cell block. Glitch number three. This utilizes glitch number two, so do everything I said before and make sure your dog is still with you when you get caught. Now what you have to do is push your dog into the corner until it's on the other side of the wall. Then make your dog stay still and do the handshake trick. This will allow you to escape. However, because you messed with the jail, you can't actually get caught in the town. Just don't enter a new area, and this includes elevators. You can run around the city, you can torment innocent civilians, steal their cars, and the police will show up, but they won't notice you. I hope you enjoyed this video. I think it's pretty fun. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then consider subscribing. I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next one.